Hello everyone! It's me again, Mr. Alexis R. Osorio. At ngayong araw na ito ay pag-uusapan natin ang adding and subtracting rational algebraic expressions with like denominator. So dito, malalaman natin kung paano ba mag-add at subtract ng rational algebraic expression na magkaparehas ang denominator. So una, alamin natin kung paano ba mag-add at subtract ng fractions na may magkaparehas na denominators. So, paano ba yun? So, we have if A, B, and C represent real numbers and C is not equal to 0, then A over C plus B over C is equal to A plus B over C and A over C minus B over C is equal to A minus B over C. So, paano ba yan? Magbigay tayo ng ilang halimbawa kung paano mag-add at subtract ng fraction na may magkaparehas na denominators. Number 1, 3 over 14 plus 2 over 14. Kung makikita natin dito, magkaparehas yung denominators. Ang denominators ng dalawang fractions ay 14. So, ang gagawin natin dyan, kukopyahin lang natin. At ngayon, pag nakopya na natin ang denominator, yung naman numerator ang kailangan natin ayusin. So, kapag ka nag add tayo ng dalawang fractions na magkaparehas ang denominator, just add the numerators. 3 plus 2. Ganun lang kasimple. Kukunin lang natin yung sum ng numerators. At ang magiging sagot natin dyan ay 5 over 14. Ganun lang kasimple kung paano kumuha ng sum. At let's go to Number 2. Example number 2 ay 9 over 10 minus 5 over 10. Subtraction naman tayo ngayon. Pero magkaparehas pa rin ang denominators. Pag magkaparehas ang denominators, kukopihin lang. At ang gagawin natin sa numerator, kung ito ay subtraction, minus lang natin. Ang mangyayari dyan ay 9 minus 5. I-simplify lang natin ang 9 minus 5 magiging 4 over 10. Pero hindi pa to ang lowest term ng sagot natin kasi pwede pa siyang i-lowest term. Ang 4 over 10 ay pwede pang maging 2 over 5. So ang final answer dito ay 2 over 5. Example number 3. 7 over 18 plus 2 over 18. Katulad ng mga nauna, kukopyahin lang natin si 18. At ang numerators, kukunin lang natin ang sum. 7 plus 2. 7 plus 2 is equal to 9. And copy the denominator. 18. 9 over 18. Pero kung mapapansin natin, pwede pa itong i-lowest term. Ang lowest term nito ay 1 half. So, ang final answer dito is 1 half. Ganun lang kasimple kapag ka nag add or subtract ng fraction na magkaparehas ang denominators. So, this time, your turn. Kayo naman na magsasagot ng numbers 1 at 2 involving addition and subtraction of similar fractions. I will give you 30 seconds to answer. Yun, mukhang tapos na kagad magsagot. Sa so number 1, 5 over 18 plus 3 over 18, ito ay magiging 8 over 18. Pero ito ay pwede pang i-reduce sa lowest term. Kung ang sagot mo ay 4 over 9, therefore, you are correct. Number 2, 12 over 25 minus 2 over 25. Ito ay magiging 10 over 25. Pero pwede pang i-lowest term, magiging 2 over 5. Kung 2 over 5 ang sagot mo, you are correct. Okay, ngayon, dumako naman tayo kung paano mag-add and subtract 
ng rational algebraic expressions na magkaparehas pa rin ang denominator. So, the addition and subtraction of rational algebraic expressions are also similar to those of fractions. When rational algebraic expressions with the same denominators are added or subtracted, we need only to add or subtract the numerators with the denominator remaining unchanged. Let us give example. Okay, number one, we have 4 over y plus 3 over y. Kung mapapansin natin ang denominators ng dalawang rational algebraic expressions ay parehong y. So, katulad lang lang sa fractions, the common denominator is y. Combine the numerators. So, we will just copy y, yung denominator natin, at yung numerators, we will just combine them. 4 plus 3. Next, add the numerators. Copy the denominator. So, from there, we can simplify 4 plus 3. 4 plus 3 is equal to 7. At kokopyahin lang natin yung denominator, which is y, and this is now the final answer. So, ganun lang kasimple. 7 over y ang sagot natin sa number 1. Ay paano naman kaya kapag ganito ang ating example? Ang denominators natin ay naging uh, binomial composed of two terms. Mahirap ba kapag ka naging binomial ang denominators? So, tignan natin. 9x over 3x plus 4 plus 12 over 3x plus 4. Step 1. The common denominator is 3x plus 4. Combine the numerators. The same process pa rin tayo. Kukopyahin lang si 3x plus 4 dahil common denominator yan. At ang sabi dito, combine the numerators. So, pagsasamahin lang natin si 9x and 12, magiging 9x plus 12. Second step, factor the numerator. Kailangan daw natin i-factor si numerator kasi kung mapapansin natin, factorable nga naman siya. 9x and 12. So, kung matatandaan natin, ang 9x at, uh, at 12 ay merong greatest common monomial factor na naging lesson natin noong nakaraan. So, ang greatest common monomial factor ng 9x and 12 is 3. Kasi 3 ay common sa kanilang dalawa. Ngayon, this will serve as our first factor. Ang pangalawang factor natin, i-divide natin ngayon si 9x by 3. 9x divided by 3, ang magiging sagot ay 3x. Sunod, si 12 naman. 12 divided by 3, 4 ang magiging sagot. At kokopyahin lang natin yung denominator kasi uh, this is like denominators of two rational algebraic expressions. Na-factor out na natin yung numerator. Ang sunod na gagawin natin is cancel the common factor. Meron bang common factor ang numerator at denominator? Meron. 3x plus 4 at 3x plus 4. So, pwede nating i-cancel yan dahil ang 3x plus 4 divided by 3x plus 4, 1 ang magiging sagot. Ang natira na lang ay 3. So, therefore, 9x over 3x plus 4 plus 12 over 3x plus 4 is equal to 3. And this 3 is our final answer. Next example. So ngayon naman, ang example natin is 9 over x minus 7 over x. Subtraction naman tayo. So kung mapapansin natin, uh, parehas ang denominators. First step, the common denominator is x. Subtract the numerators. Ang una natin gagawin, kokopyahin lang yung denominator na x. At yung numerators naman, we will just uh, subtract them. That will be 9 minus 7. Next, copy the denominator. Next step is, we need to copy the denominator and 
After copying the denominator, we need to subtract 9 and 7. Ang magiging sagot doon ay 2 at ang denominator natin is x. Sinabtract lang natin si numerator and copy the denominator which is x and that will be our final answer. 2 over x. Napakasimple. So, ganun lang kadali kung paano mag-add and subtract ng uh, rational algebraic expressions with like denominators. Next example. 9x squared over 3x minus 1 minus 1 over 3x minus 1. Ang denominators ulit natin ngayon ay magkaparehas pero it composed of two terms. So, binomials naman ang ating denominators. First step natin, the common denominator is 3x minus 1. Subtract the numerators. So, kung yun ang common denominator natin, we will just copy it. 3x minus 1. At ang sabi ay subtract the numerators. Ang numerators natin ay 9x squared and 1. Dahil ito ay subtraction, magiging 9x squared minus 1. Nakuha na natin yung sa first step. Let's move to the second step. Factor the numerator and copy the denominator. Ang numerator natin is 9x squared minus 1. If a factor daw natin to. So kung maaalala natin, Ang 9x squared at 1 ay parehong perfect square at ang nasa gitna nila is a minus sign. So, this is difference of 2 squares. Kung matatandaan, kung yan ay difference of 2 squares, we will just find the square root of 9x squared and 1. Ang square root ng 9x squared ay 3x. Ang square root ng 1 ay 1. So, ang magiging factors natin, Meron tayong 3x1, 3x1. Pero, ang sign nito, isang positive at isang negative. So, therefore, ang factors ay 3x plus 1 times the quantity 3x minus 1. And, we will just copy the denominator. Ang denominator natin is 3x minus 1. After factoring the numerator, let's go to the third process. Cancel the common factor. May common factor ba? Kung mapapansin natin, yes, merong common factor. 3x minus 1 at 3x minus 1. So kung na-factor na natin or na-cancel na natin ang common factor, meron bang natira sa numerator at denominator? Meron. At ang natira dito ay 3x plus 1. So, therefore, the answer here, 9x squared over 3x minus 1 minus 1 over 3x minus 1 is 3x plus 1. So, this is now the final answer. Pwede natin hindi i-enclose sa parenthesis dahil ang 3x plus 1 ay nasa uh, simplified form na. So, therefore, this is our final answer. So, let's remember on how you can add or subtract rational algebraic expressions with like denominators. Uh, napakadali lang. Kung parehas ng denominator, just copy the denominator and perform the operation in the numerator kung yan ay addition or subtraction. So, that's all for today. So, sana ay may natutunan kayo on how we can add and subtract uh, rational algebraic expressions with like denominator. If you have question, if you have a comment or something to say about the lesson, just uh, comment down below and I will make sure to respond to it. Uh, by the way, I use uh, the book Grade 8 Mathematics Patterns and Practicalities under Gladys Sinivera, PhD, as my reference for this video. Okay, so, kita-kita ulit tayo sa susunod na video. Maraming salamat at goodbye!